Okay, we have a slight problem. Now this dude's directly in the way. Come on, damn it. Okay, get your freaking break around here. I swear to God. Bigger problem! Bigger problem! Yo, what's going on, guys? Riot's here, back with episode 5 of our freaking Monster Hunter survival series in Ark Survival Evolved. Last episode, it didn't end well. I don't want to ruin anything for anyone who hasn't seen it, but it did not end very well. And this episode is kind of starting on a much worse foot than last time. I keep getting attacked by these freaking corrupt creatures that started coming through about an hour ago. Oh, crap, raptors. Once this freaking extinction, I mean corruption portal opened up right outside of our base and letting in all sorts of evil and every Every hour or so more and more evil keeps pouring through this thing and I can't damage it. That's what the pike is for I pretty much figured this would be my life now for the rest of the day until this thing is destroyed I don't know, but then I keep getting attacked by crap by it like this the morphodon It's basically like an unforeseen circumstance of, of the likes of which I've never had to deal with. That was a hell of a snipe in Ark Survival Evolved before. I'm really confused and scared and a little frustrated, but mostly confused and scared. And yes, this is pretty much my life right now. In a normal survival series, we'd be having a pretty positive time because like I just made darts and just made a trait grapple and civilization's moving forward. But now this portal to the fucking upside down just opened up. I didn't mean to cuss right there. And now we have other issues on our hands. Make sure to leave a like on this video if you haven't already for the survival series just to help wish me good luck with this portal and of course check out my reaction channel down below as usual. Alright now back to other things at hand. I, 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 I have to kind of keep my lookout. I don't freaking even remotely understand what to do about this. This is what's a nice place like I was gonna tame a flyer and go taming but now there's corrupt dinosaurs pouring through and this island is quickly with this island that once protected us because obviously creatures had to cross an ocean to get to us is now our doom where we have no escape and the monsters have nowhere to go. They're just gonna make their way to the freaking temple like this trike is doing right now. This is the craziest freaking thing I've ever gone through in a survival series before. There was like some cool things to tame around here too, though I was excited. I made a metal cage, we're gonna tame some cool stuff. All those cool things have been eaten by now. By the rest of the creatures on the island. I guess, yeah, there's nothing else I can do except freaking take a... Take a weapon to this thing and try to reclaim my homeland. It's gonna take like 30 hours, but there's, there's, there's nothing else I can do right now. In other news, I've moved Sam to a strictly potato-based diet to... Kind of just get a more natural pelt type situation going. I don't know what to do about this. We go to the top of our pyramid. But then we're just screwed, but at the top of a pyramid. Ah! What's happening? Nowhere is safe, dude. The Demorphodons found us up here. Jesus Christ. And slowly but surely our house is being destroyed. The series is ridiculous, dude. No, they have it down 100 health. Like, if this house breaks, all of our stuff inside this house breaks. <laughs> It'd be the most, dis the most dis disappointing thing ever. Quick, while they're distracted, we go around. We have to destroy this portal. It's only gonna get worse. Right now, we just have the little things coming through. Oh, no, the, the drugs! Crap, I stepped in drugs. But right now, it's just the little things. Eventually, the freaking T-Rexes and Wyverns and crap is gonna come through. I can't believe this has happened to me of all times. It was what happened in the survival series where I'm trying not to die ever as well. This mod is out of control. It makes Ark so much goddamn harder. I can't even really hear when things are creeping up on me either. You can kind of hear the feats. But you don't get much of a warning at all. I can't believe I finally did it. This is actually insane. Oh my god, it's so quiet now. I've done it. I've single-handedly beat the beast. Oh my god, I just freaking might have rushed some serious diseases. Like... <laughs> Carpal tunnel coming in freaking hot after that one, but we've done it. Freaking done it. Finally start the episode. 20 minutes in, still a bunch of evil crap all over the island destroying stuff. But nevertheless, the thing is done. You know the biggest slap in the face though that hurts the most really is that it didn't drop anything. It's just there just to create havoc and cause nightmare crap in my life. Please don't break focus on the fact that you're trying to break your own rock, you stupid raptor. If you turn, you'll be so annoying. What's making noise? Damn it! I'm so tired. The Demorphodons have by far been the worst part of all of this. They're the worst things created. Why do I hear a holier than holy rock sound? Get out of here, little bastard! Can you hear that? It sounds like... It sounds like increasing evil. Like something evil's lurking up in the vicinity, kinda. 
This is like the end of the final episode of a season of Stranger Things. The freaking noise that would play that indicates that greater evil is down the line. How is that heat seeking? I zigzagged. And I'm just gonna go ahead and live my life. You know, there's plenty of room. Not the drugs! I'm trying not to die. Please don't die. I got followed in by Demorphodons. Unfreaking believable. At least the portal's dead, right? <gasps> oh, we didn't die with 10 health like a freaking genius. I'm living in a t terrible situation. Health is going back up. We will survive this. I can't believe we got that freaking portal dead. And we didn't even die. So awesome. Dude, the house has lost a suspicious amount of health like a very sketchy amount of health i am i am one with concern and this is like this this service is i don't know if we're gonna make it out of this dude like i don't know if our house is gonna make it out of this i can make it out of it just fine you can always continue to worm your way across the land in this game no matter what but our house on the other hand i don't know if that's gonna make it out of this what do we need damn it no we have enough we should easily have enough for all this I don't know if we still have, we're still a complete one shot though. Most people would usually just kill themselves at this point in the game to let themselves come back with more health, but again, trying to avoid death. He's just chewing on our house though, and although it looks like they've been doing it forever without issue, eventually they're gonna get through, and then it's gonna be real freaking embarrassing. Oh, we have never looked fancier. My god, I definitely look like the kind of guy who would live with the dodo in a symbiotic relationship. Well, at least we have three of these healing mushrooms, so, you know, let's not, let's not worry too much. We might be fine. You! You little spawn of Satan! You're gonna be the one that gives us flack, aren't you? Oh, no. You see it? Oh, shit! Bad situation! Bad situation! Get out of here! I've got a freaking Demorphodon in the living room. Are you kidding me right now? Crap. Don't you finish me. Don't you freaking do it. Don't you freaking do it. Don't you... Don't you do it! I hate this! Get out of here! Oh yes! Ha 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 ha! Sam, get in the middle of the room! It's another one, dude. A level 140. I don't know how we're getting out of this situation. I'm not healing quick enough. There's... The English are too many. No, dude. It's down to 7,000 now. It's dropping fast. Oh my god. Look how fast our health health is dropping. <laughs> Chris, go wake up, damn it! <laughs> That's no time for a nap, you bastard. Alas, he has fallen. Okay, the Demorphodons are taken care of. That should theoretically be all of them, right? No more should come through. The portal is gone. The worst of it should be over, theoretically. Thank God we got the portal caught in time before the freaking bigger things started feeding through. I assume those rocks are going to take a decade and a half to get through. And we're trying to avoid death in every way, shape, and form right now. So what we're going to do, the most strategic way to go about this, is we're going to expand our empire a little bit. Where is it? The freaking Emperor Hut. Inca Emperor Hut, you shall be crafted, boy. And we're going to use you as an advantage over our enemies. As it provides shelter, cover, and is downright the fanciest thing ever. Do not freaking bite me while I do this, please, for the love of God. Thank you. Where are you at? I feel like you can still bite me from up here. Easy. At least we can kind of get him with like a slight sense of security. This is the right amount of cowardice for Johnny Boy right here. We got him. He was only level 10. The loser. All right, the last of the evil is officially evacuated off our island. Everyone leave a like down below if you haven't already. Unless you're not one of those people that I totally understand. It's fine. It's just this was a big victorious day for us right here. There's still another trike, but I just cannot freaking be bothered. It is shameful there's nothing really to tame here now, though, because the corrupted dinosaurs killed everything. Oh, and just like that, our house is full again. Wait, no, damn it. Hey, hey. Oh, wait, no, it's repairing. Okay, I'm sorry. I forgot, <laughs> I thought it, I forgot it doesn't happen instantly. Some mods, it does. Wait, we have extra potatoes. Look at all these eggs you've been crapping out. You've been having a heart attack, haven't you, Sam? I'm going to eat your children. Damn, they destroyed my smithy. I didn't even notice that. Oh, now I'm all fat. Thanks a lot. Man, they're really freaking... How they just threw the smithy through the walls? Walls are a freaking lie. Society made up... Oh, no. We don't have enough... Ah, oh, shit. Why did the octopus beat the shark in a fight? Because it was well-armed. Ha! Why did the octopus beat the shark in the fight? Because it was well-armed. I swear to God, if it wasn't for Ava, I'd have killed myself long ago. Alright, we have the utensils necessary to tame a creature, except I don't want to just tame the first 
the first dandy that comes our way, you know what I'm saying? There's too many epic things out there. I suppose I should just pack up and hit the hit the road on ink and panties over here. Alright, if we're going on an adventure, I'm sorry, but we have to take a regular raft. For two reasons. If we tame anything, we have to be able to bring it back with us. And I would love to be able to put a freaking storage crate on the raft just to hold some of my crap, you know? I do love that Incan boat a lot, but it's more of a luxury lounge type situation. And if Crisco's not here, there's there's absolutely no reason to be all fancy about it. I mean, there's plenty of reason, but it's just not what we should do right now. Why am I so fat? Sam, you f I swear to God, it's really all somebody needs in this world to survive is, is a dodo. Like, everything else is just so over the top. You don't need dinosaurs to survive, bro. Relax. All you need is a little helper dodo to carry a slight weight around sometimes. Sam, you're really making me look stupid right now, bud. Alright, every single episode we've ended so far, getting absolutely nothing done and just being completely cursed individuals. I maintain this isn't our fault in any way, shape, and form and that this world is just very freaking difficult. But at the same time, it's going to be really hard to pass that excuse off for a long time. I want one of these things so bad. They're not like the classic arc rays. They're... What the hell is that? Oh, that's one of those giant freaking things to just avoid. These are the ones from Atlas, right? The ones where you could like, I don't know. They're different somehow and they're freaking huge. Jesus, Jesus Christ, a phantom manta. That's so cool. Thank you for your reason, for your contribution. And then it just goes down to the bottom of the ocean to be consumed by monsters. Yep, see, consumed by monsters. What the, what, what would you call this thing if not a monster? That could not have been a better freaking presumption for what was going to happen. Look at its crazy little claws, whatever the hell those things are called. Dude, these phantom mantas are all over the place. I hear Valhazak yells, and we all, it's because we just saw it an island like right behind us. It's like the most kite I've ever gotten in my life before. I mean, obviously not, but like, it's just, I don't know. I didn't expect to get any resources on the top of the ocean. I would love to freaking tame a Valhaz. Oh, there's Raffinos over there too. Ooh, crap. Those would be so freaking cool to have. Just one of them, you know? Just to, but like, I imagine they do that annoying freaking thing where once you um, shoot them, once you get their torpor kind of low, they just book it. Or do they do that and just explode into a million pieces? What the hell is up here, too? I saw glowing eyeballs. Is this just a super weird gotcha? No, it's like a Shit! Oh my god, that thing is nightmares! That thing is nightmares and diarrhea all wrapped in one. Please, God, let me get away! Please, Jesus, it's all I want life! Sail! Ah! Sail, I guess I made a point! Grapple. We have to grapple up now. Grapple up, grapple up, grapple up. That thing is freaking terrifying. God bless armor, am I right? Jesus Christ. Spider-Man powers, bitch! Jesus Christ, I didn't expect a man-bear pig to get mauling me in the woods. No one, no one ever expects man-bear pig mauling. It just happens, I suppose. You missed! Ah! Is he tracking me? You're tracking me, aren't you? Big fella. Yeah, you are. Alright, if I could lose this thing's focus, but see, the downside is when you lose something's focus, in this world, they always just go off and attack other stuff. And because this world is so freaking violent, that always means they die shortly after. Nice to know there's bajillions of metal nearby. No, I hear roars also. The same similar roars! If that valve is up... Yeah, if that thing comes over here, we're gonna all get one-shotted. And... That would suck. After all the death I've avoided this episode, to so just get one-shotted. By a freaking demon. The boat! The, 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 the shit! Hang on. They can't believe you did that to me, you bastard. Makes sense. Everyone's a bad person around here. Okay, see, this is awkward because I only brought one wall high. I didn't, I didn't expect to find freaking monsters. So natural. Oh god, I'm so panicky right now. No one likes being over encumbered when there's like things that want to kill them in the vicinity. I don't think one wall high is going to contain that monster. In fact, I'm pretty goddamn sure it won't. I also love the freaking the weight balancing in this world. To like match all the crazy monsters, I could hold a thousand chitin in it. It kind of just put me down to the ground, thank god. I will be very freaking surprised if this holds this thing. Super surprised. It's weird how many weird monsters we've downloaded just off Nexus. 
So again, I don't really know what the hell's in here until we see it. I don't need 500. I mean, I, I don't need a thousand. I could freaking come back and get some and try to cut down on my fatties. Please land. Yes, I'm a sniper. Okay, we have a slight problem. Now this dude's directly in the way. Come on, damn it. Okay, get some freaking break around here. I swear to God. Bigger problem! Bigger problem! Bigger problem! Bigger problem! Oh, good, he jumped right out of there. But I can't! Ah! Good thing he barely does any freaking damage. Make it over the thing, make it over the thing, make it over the thing. This is my rock now. This is my home. He can't be that high of a level. He's barely tickling me. 30? The friggin' dragon bear. You know what this guy would be perfect for? Which is something I'd be pretty fond of right now. Is just something to run around the island. Killing stuff that messes with me. I feel like that would be fantastic. That's exactly what I need in my life. And, I don't know. Look, look, look how close we are. We really don't even need boats. I might just be being overdramatic. Look, creatures have started to spawn again on the land. Hang on. Oh, I was blinded by the light. That's what happened there. All right, I'm pretty sure I see that thing getting in a fight with something else right now. I forgot two freaking walls. I miscounted. I freaking miscounted. That's so embarrassing. I had all the way back. Okay, I see this thing getting in a fight around the corner, and I'm so worried about its life right now because that Andrew Sukas was a pretty big beast, I'm pretty sure. And it has been killed. That is... That is just so sweet on my soul right now. That's exactly what I needed. I knew it would. It was level 30. It was a freaking scrub. Yeah, this Kodiak bear just freaking destroyed that one creek. Oh, Jesus! He would actually be a very cool first thing to have guarding our little area base. Assuming he could even get up here. I needed to put two more ramps in. Well, here's the ultimate test. Can he defeat this bastard who's been killing everything I like around here? It seems to be a ridiculously OP creature for level 60. Oh, I don't know. It's showing damage indication. Yeah, we should just get a freaking Angie Sukas. Those things are insane also. Battle of the Titans right here. Oh my god, I'm so concerned. He killed it. He freaking killed it. Now I probably gotta make haste, right? Bag him and caged him. Caged him. Damn it, I messed up the sentence. Either way, this thing's a beast. I just watched it kill everything on this freaking island, and it's a giant bear, which just is awesome. Please don't. Oh, I was worried about such a thing. Damn it. You just play it safe. Do the little jump and shoot. Yeah, I can do that. Damn it! The jump and shoot has failed me. Oh, here we go. Even better. So that was scary as hell. Look at his face. Look at his big bear ears. It's oh, big bear face. We need a bear on the team. Ooh, it's on the run. It's going down in a second. So that's what I like. Unless it's already asleep and I'm just kind of... Nope, 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 nope. Wow, that thing's face is so beautiful. So this is why you're in the cage, buddy. Because everyone always tries to run towards the end. First they fight, then they flee. I guess you're still not down. I would like to kill one of these big suckers over here to give it some prime meat. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do such a thing, though. Is this guy asleep and I'm just shooting him? He seems very awake right now. But also kind of asleep? No, nope. now definitely awake. What level are you, bud? Level 40? It must be done. This is the way. We have to get the younglings prime meat. Your sacrifice shall go towards a good cause, big buddy. Yes, I'm talking about rare prime meat. We're getting out of here just in time, too, because a bunch of lions are starting to spawn on the other side of the island, and it's starting to sketch me out a little bit. Because lions, I don't know, large carnivorous cats, Shit's scary. Oh, we've done it. We've given the beast what thy needs. Yeah, that'll do it right there. Yes. Oh, look at it stand up. Okay, we gotta get you a saddle, buddy. I don't think it takes a specific one. Nope, it specifically does a specific saddle. You dirty bastard. Hopefully we have enough. I mean, we should have plenty because we've robbed the crap out of those beaver dens, but we've also been constructing and building like madmen. Yes. Yes, we have enough. I'm not even taking the boat over. I'm just swimming over. It's so freaking right next door. Dude, aside from that one corrupt trike just kind of wrecking the place up, this place is... Just, I'm seeing so much life forms spawning again. It's so nice seeing your, like, your home go back to normal. Moment of freaking truth. I guess it doesn't have that much health. It does have a good amount of melee, and it can be crafted in, which is pretty freaking awesome. You can make bear traps in this bear. Riddle me that one. That's just eight kinds of confusing right there. Hang on, get, get, get a little stuck. Love handles. I have trouble squeezing out of there, buddy. It happens. 
spots, okay? It's no shame. Can you see that there now, right? Maybe foot, foot stuck a little bit. I don't know. There, there we go. Now we're talking. Look at all this stuff this bear could hold. Jesus. Several shirts and several little backpacks. That's what I'm talking about. I think with this guy, we're going to go specifically melee and health. Our big Kodiak buddy. My head just sticks out. This guy's sole purpose right now is base defense. We seriously need a lot of base defense going on. If I had a freaking Kodiak bear earlier, it wouldn't have taken me 30 minutes to destroy a portal to another evil dimension. That's just simple math right there. There's flyers all over the place too. Grab a few of those suckers, there's taxis. Finally, gonna eat these little Ostroraptors. I know you guys are a beautiful part of the ecosystem, but you're also easy kills and I need the XP. Yep, I knew the other one would not be happy about such a thing. Ooh, if we could get this bat killed also. Because this is the only other thing killing everything on the island. Giant evil bats. Pretty much also a sign of the apocalypse. It might be Dracula. I don't know. Haven't looked into it. Could easily be him. Get out of here, dude. Flying fisherman. Yes. Yes, dominance. Once again, the supreme species on the island. It feels good, man. Where is he? Where's that corrupt trike bastard? Giving my- look, he's still attacking my base. This guy's got a real goddamn attitude problem. And now he's got damage indication on his butt. That's how it freaking goes around here. As far as I can tell, that was the last corrupt creature on this island. Our home is saved. Our people, once again, protected and feeling safe in their homes. It's a beautiful time. You know what else is pretty spectacular? We have a berry gather on our island. Like, that was another freaking logic of mine behind this. Another bit of my logic. There's a Val Hazak right where we just were, right by our cage. How does that always happen? I swear to God, next episode I'm gonna get online, there's gonna be a Val Hazak right outside our base, and it's gonna be just Boogaloo 3000. Gathering all them freaking fruits, all them taters, gather them corn, get a seat, see the bats, dude. They're just killing the lovely little things on my island. That is a beautiful flyer over there, though. Hello. I wonder if we should just tame one of these bats. It would be pretty freaking cool. Roll around town on giant bats. But right now, they're more just XP farm. The way I see it. This bear needs to get stronger. He needs to be ready for whatever the hell I'm gonna load into next episode. It is pretty freaking amazing having an unlimited supply of food. Right here. Right on our base. We could just live off the land if we wanted to. I won't, but we could. Please tell me you could fit inside here, buddy. I'd be very freaking sad if you can't. Oh lord, he too thick, what we gonna do? Even building a little freaking Inca area for him doesn't fill me with that much hope because, like of course, oh, I thought this was a giraffe right in my face. Because, because of course, like, there's a bunch of corrupt evil this all over. I don't know, man. They were flying. Freaking the Morphodons are swarming us. The, there is no safety anywhere. I'm sure if we all say a prayer down below. Below? Below? Below. To our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. <laughs> what? I'm sure if we all say a prayer down below in the comment section. For our Lord and Savior Rabbi Jesus. That is the most we could probably do to keep this bear protected. I mean, theoretically, he'd be perfectly fine, but of course, then I got on last uh, this episode and there was a portal to the Upside Down spawning all sorts of evil, which of course does freaking raise suspicions a little bit. Makes you wonder what's gonna be on there next time you get online. You're doing fine, bud. Of course, you're putting the feeding trough inside because, I mean, obvious reasons. We will be naming this guy next episode. I'm gonna get some more name suggestions from you guys and I'm gonna thank it over just a good name for him because this one might not be a temporary life like our other ones. Yes, see, we feed our creatures well around here, bro. Fruits and veggies. All right, we've done it. We survived today's episode and we freaking went positive instead of going negative. I'm so happy. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.